Good morning. It's just me. Val's still asleep. It's 7.30. So, gonna let her sleep in and I am on my way to um, hospital in Riverside to get my lovely cast removed. So, next time you see me, I should have both hands free and I might actually be able to get something done. So, I'm looking forward to it. Not looking forward to this traffic because of crazy people out there this early in the morning. So, see ya when it's off. Bye. Okay, so um, I didn't get any pictures of my x-rays or anything because they were real quick and showing them to me. It says I still have a crack that hasn't filled in quite right and that they wanted me to wear a, a brace. And I have the brace, but right now I'm not gonna wear it because I can't get into my pockets. <laughs> to get my keys and stuff. So I'll see how I'm feeling, whether I'm gonna wear the brace or not. And, uh, oh. Hmm. Wow, parking lot's a mess. So I'm happy to finally get it off. Uh, I'm very hungry. I think I'm gonna go get myself something to eat before I go home and make uh, Val some breakfast. It's about 9.30. Took me about an hour and a half in there. So, um, yeah, that's that. Uh, my wrist does hurt from motion. Let's see how that's gonna work out. Good morning, neighborhood community. Good morning. I still feel like a pile of poo-poo. Oh, I'm sorry. No. We had plans for tonight, but we're going to have to cancel them because I'm not in any condition to deal with this. So that's it. That's it. I, I'm miserable, guys. I'm, I can't even really talk. I'm sorry. Mm. Well. Huh? Huh? It's got a lot of dead skin on it still because it's... Uh, I just got home, but um, I have to decide what it is I want to do today. Do I want to paint? Hello. Or hey. do I want to pull weeds? Val's on the phone. Yes, so I'm going to go right now. Bye. So I had planned on painting a uh, second coat of trim on uh, this. And there's uh, other parts that still hasn't gotten the first coat yet, like over here. But... Um, I still have ant issues. I just chalked the floor. But, um, with the ant chalk. And last time I did that, they didn't seem to care. But, um, yeah, I don't know why they're in this time. There must be something to eat. But, uh, they're, they're everywhere now. So, usually, if I chalk, or at least it used to be, I chalk within a half hour, they would have disappeared. Or maybe try to come in from somewhere else but we'll see what happens so I'm not going to do any painting I don't want to have to try and get ants out of my paint so I'm just going to clean up a little more in the garage that's what I'm gonna do so guys we have some company that stopped by and they're right now looking at all my colorings what's <laughs> happening Taylor and Bree stop by. Mr. and Mrs. Lynn. Yeah. <laughs> we uh, tied the knot, so to speak. Yeah. And that's funny to me because I was staring at Celtic knotting. <laughs> 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 and um, we were supposed to, unfortunately, with me being so sick, we can't do it. Um, we're supposed to go to their house tonight because they just moved into a new house with Jake and Jordan and their two children and they are having some paranormal activity. So we'll let them tell you a little bit of what's going on. Oh, where to start? Um, I guess the first little bit of stuff that had happened in the house wasn't that well, big. It was we the bought cabinets opening. The girls, the girls were gone, and Jake and I were at home putting together a patio set we had just bought from a home improvement store, and we were watching 
shadow people walk back and forth across our double doors. And uh, lots and lots of knocking. Uh, there's always knocking. There's constantly knocking. And it's not just like, not like water heater knocking or like stagnant house noise knocking. Like a like, yeah, like knocking. Boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Mm-hmm. Or we'll be in the shower. I'll be I'll be in the shower or something, and I'll hear something fall in the kids' room. Go in there, and there's there's nothing wrong with anything. It's just everything's fine. Or the kids sounds... are sleeping in their room. Yeah, the other night and... we were the other night we were sitting there, and, and I was like, oh, hey, Jake, um, I think Annabelle's awake. So he got up and he goes, he walks down to the end of the hallway, and he sits there and he's listening to the door, and he swears that Annabelle is playing in the room, and so. He, you know, he's going to sneak up on her to catch her in the act because she's supposed to be in bed. So he opens up the door, all the lights are off, and she's dead asleep. She passed out. And, um, but there's, there's something in her room. And she's, she's scared to sleep in her room. She wakes up and, you know, every couple hours screaming. And it's, it's not only affecting us, but it's affecting Jake and Jordan especially. They look like, you know... Their character from The Walking Dead, <laughs> and uh, yeah, that's too well, bad. And then the we were hanging out one night. We were all getting ready to go to bed, and I came out of the bathroom, and the kids' room is straight across the hall from Jake and Jordan's bedroom. And I went in to say something to Jordan real quick before we all went to bed, and I turned around facing the kids' room, and like I could see a full-grown person like sitting in the corner in Annabelle's bed, just like sitting there. Like a shadow of a person, the only thing you could see was their eyes. Um, it was like the whites of their eyes, and it was like, oh, okay. Yeah. Fun stuff. So we uh, we gave him one of our cameras. Ooh, I gotta put the... Ooh. So we uh, gave him one of our cameras, and they're gonna set it up because they said they have cabinet doors opening. Yeah, our kitchen cabinets Pretty and stuff frequently. open and so all the time. We want to see if we can catch that. That's great. What you doing over there, handsome? Well, the sound system on our TV is kind of going out. And we've got this awesome surround sound system, but it's been in the garage. Because we were didn't want to put it back together since we were going to move. We're going to be here for a little while yet, so. Yeah, so. And our speakers and our TV aren't working that well, so it we're makes more sense. We're watching a lot more of it. Yeah, it makes it. more sense to have the surround sound put back up, so. This, this is my, our giant subwoofer. Boys, it's fun. What was on that shelf? Just fill and the oh. candle. I just moved it over. Uh. So, I'll have to do some rearranging. A bit of an older system, but it's a 7 to 1 system that you you don't see much anymore. So. Cat wants in. <coughs> and how's your hand feeling since you got your cast off? My palm hurts. Why does that happen? You said it happened to you too. Yeah, my hand it's hurt and swelled up. It's all swollen. Yeah, my hand hurt and swelled up in here because of where I broke uh-huh. mine. And it's all swollen here. Yeah. And it itches like mad. Well, put some lotion on. Okay. Okay. Okay, so that's it for today. We actually did quite a bit. Had people come over. I did a little work, but my hand hurts. So I'm not going to work anymore today. It's getting late. So. I've been coloring, relaxing, visiting with our friends. And yes, that is Boomer. (laughs) And that's about it. Why my socks? Huh? Kevin needs clean socks. (laughs) 
Anyways, we hope you enjoyed a little bit of something that you may have seen in our video this evening. If you did, please give us a favorite, a share. Please leave us a comment. And please subscribe. And we will see you guys all tomorrow. Ta-ta for now. Bye. 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 Bye.